sweating, itching, pinching, maybe they're hanging too low. They're all telltale signs that you're about to do one thing. You're going to adjust. Ha! What's up you guys? It's Jose Zaniga from Teaching Men's Fashion and for this week's video, I'm going to help you do something that all of us have to do sooner or later. You're going to adjust in public. So I'm going to be giving you three easy, pretty good tips on how to handle or address the problem of having to adjust in public. So the first one, you're going to hate me for this, just don't. That's right, just don't adjust. You adjusting in public is probably one of the most distasteful things you'll do and it's also pretty much disrespectful to the people around you if they catch you doing it and it also makes people around you uncomfortable. Now don't get me wrong, every guy that is watching this right now has been in a situation where they need to adjust. Sometimes you just have to do it, but my ultimate tip to you is try not to do it in public. The best thing to do is find a restroom or at best if you really need to adjust, it's pinching or it's crushing, whatever is happening down there. Go to a corner. If you're shopping, go behind a shopping cart. Whatever you can do to not actually do it in public. So that's my first tip and probably the best one. So now the second one is the complete opposite. This is if all else fails, you cannot find your nearest restroom, you cannot find somewhere to hide, and if you take one more step, you might cry. You're gonna have to adjust right here, right now. And this is the trick I call the coin in the pocket trick. Pretty simple. Act as if you're walking, take one easy step with the leg opposite to the side you're about to adjust. Then stick your hand in the pocket in the side you're going to adjust and dig deep as if you're looking for something. Did you catch that? Probably didn't. So what happens is you're digging in deep as if you're looking for something, but you're not looking for anything. You're gonna do one quick flick and you're adjusted. This is the most effective way to adjust in public and probably 99.9% .9 of the people around you will not be the wiser. But like I said, this is not my preferred method. This is extreme worst case scenario. I'd rather prevent rather than have to react and be in that position. What does that mean? That means that I'd rather take the steps necessary, which leads me to tip number three, to not have to be in that position. And that is finding the right underwear. And I've talked about this in a recent video already where finding the right underwear, underwear that it's not gonna stretch out like your cheap Hanes or your cheap Fruit of the Loom, is gonna make a world of difference. You're probably not gonna have to adjust again finding an underwear that it's actually supportive. Something that has a little bit of elasticity that's gonna help keep your man goods in check and in the same position all day. And that's why I always tell you guys, find quality underwear, find good underwear, invest a little bit more. And this doesn't mean you have to invest a lot. Take for example, sheath underwear. Really high quality line, we're talking Garments are made with high quality materials, very supportive underwear, and you're not paying crazy amounts for it. It's actually very affordable underwear. But on top of that, they actually went a step further. Not only are they giving you that supportive, high quality underwear, their actual main focus is in developing underwear with a pouch, a pouch for your boys. Essentially, the front pouch will help keep your boys in place all day. They won't be swinging side to side. They'll actually be nicely tucked in that little front pouch that these underwears provide. Now, the first time that I used pouch underwear was a little bit weird. I'm not going to lie. But after about a week or so, you get so accustomed to the support that wearing any other type of underwear just feels uncomfortable. It's, <laughs> it's the weirdest thing. So my ultimate and third tip to you guys is just be preventative. Invest in good underwear that's gonna avoid you ever having to be in that position because nobody wants to be in that position, especially in a crowded room. So invest in good underwear and I can tell you right now, your chances of having to adjust are close to zero with underwear, for example, like this one with the pouch. So I'm gonna have the pouch underwear linked down below so you guys can actually check it out for yourself and see what I'm talking about. But it's a really cool design and it's something very interesting and it's aiming to solve such a basic problem that has been around since the dawn of man. So check that out if you guys are interested. So that's it for me in this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.